Natural curiosity and a sense of wonder led Samantha Schuler to KU to pursue a lifelong dream. My mom said I came home in third grade and said I wanted to be an aerospace engineer and apparently it stuck. It's been a distinguished academic career for Schuler. The Lawrence native earned her degree in aerospace engineering from KU in 2012 and stayed on campus to work on a master's degree. Along the way, she pulled off the unparalleled accomplishment of earning first place in a prestigious international aircraft design competition in consecutive years. One individual award and one team award. KU has that tradition of entering these competitions and competing against colleges around the world and typically coming out on top. Going into that tradition and being a part of that is a really cool thing. Researching aircraft in KU's wind tunnel is one part of an intensive, hands-on undergraduate experience for aerospace students. An intriguing curriculum and a dedicated faculty with a wide-ranging expertise ensure students are prepared for real-world challenges upon graduation. Top industry leaders such as Cessna, Boeing, Garmin, Spirit Aerosystems, and many more frequently recruit and hire Jayhawk engineers. KU works very hard to to get the hands-on aspect of your education because when you go out into industry, you need to know how things work, not just the theory behind it. KU is also home to the Center for Remote Sensing of Ice Sheets, which studies changes in polar ice sheets and their role in sea level rise and climate change. Access to this type of internationally acclaimed research center is extremely beneficial for students. It has activities in composites, in controls, and also in UAV areas. So that provides a lot of our undergraduate students a lot of our experience in conducting research. They are very motivated because they are working on things they love to do. Schuler's hard work and dedication have already paid off. She says while engineering can be daunting at times, persistence is a real key to success. Everybody at some point struggles, so it's nothing that like if you hit a hard spot, you're not meant for it. If you put in the hard work and you stick with it, you can be a good engineer in the end.